I actually hate creepers enough. Like, you can just see the torches through there, but hey, don't do that, you little dum dum. <laughs> Hello guys, what is up, this is Kelly, and welcome back to another Vulture SMP episode, and that actually just reminded me, I don't know if I told you guys, but yeah, we implemented a scale dropping system on the server, it was belonging to Ease and Exuma, but I uh, made my own that, you know, changed a couple things, and that's what we're using here, so, yeah, I put one of my little heads here just to symbolize, and I think Isaac's got a bunch of them over here, actually, Isaac's kind of a head hoarder, let's go take a look real quick. This is not how I intended to start the episode. <laughs> anyway, let's go take a look anyway. Socks, myself, uh, Isaac's got his head on his thing, that's a bit weird. Harry, that's Harry's head. That is a creeper over there, and I don't want him around, so I'm going to kill him. Glow, and another copy of Socks' head. And another copy of his head. Wow. Uh, but yeah, we're going to get straight into work on our little chicken area thing. Maybe I should come up with a name for that. Hmm. Yeah. The coop, maybe. The chicken coop. <laughs> I'm not sure. That's a that's a um bit of a generic name. Uh yeah, if you guys have any ideas, please let me know in the comments below. And my frame rate is dying because hoppers are happening. Um but yeah, what I was thinking is well, I've done a little bit of work since last episode. I added in this. Behind those stairs are torches. They're supposed to light up the roof a little bit. They do an alright job, and you can't really see them. I mean, you can if you look hard enough. Like, you can just see the torches through there, but... Hey, don't do that, you little dum-dum. There we go. Disposed of. And the connection to the server today is quite horrible, to say the least. Look at that. You have to wait, like, half a second almost. Crazy bad. Um... Yeah, I think that does a good idea. Uh, good idea. I think that does a good job of hiding some of the lighting in, uh, up the top. And it's not so dark as it was before. But for now, I think we're going to work on this little entranceway thing. So I'm thinking oak stairs to kind of lighten up the place. I'm using a lot of spruce uh, for the rest of it. So maybe a little bit of a lighter wood color would be good. That did not place. There we go. And I'm leaving this side because I think what we're going to do is we may use oak for this actually. But we'll try spruce first. I was going to put in some logs, and then on top of the logs, let's get some more logs. On top of the logs, I was thinking some fences, and we may do uh, oak for that too, actually. And maybe we could even put torches on top of that, but I do like that look, actually. That is not a bad look. I do like that. I do, 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 do like that. Um, what happens if we were to put some oak stairs on the bottom side like that? That's not gonna work, I don't think. But we can we can do something here. We can do something. Um, I'm trying to break those stairs with a pickaxe. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm not sure about this. Let's go and copy it over on the other side, and you know we we can we can weigh up our options after that. But uh, yeah, I don't think I said so in the last episode. I might have done. If I did, I'm so sorry. But um. Anyway, just to reiterate, the Vulture SMP applications are s open still until the 25th of August. They will remain open. So if you guys want to join us on the server here, now is your chance. You just need to make a video application and we'll review that and probably, uh, well, we'll definitely see it. And, you know, if we like it, you'll probably get on the server with us and, you know, you'll be, you'll be a Vulture. You'll be a Vulture. Anyway, uh, good luck to you if you do take part in that competition thingo application. I don't know whether you'd call it a competition. Probably not so much a competition. But it's, I guess it's kind of a competition, in a sense. But yeah, um, hopefully I remember to put a card on screen right now or a little bit before. that You, can just, you guys can just click on that and go straight to the application video. And I don't know what I'm trying to do here. I'm trying to make fences, but I'm not... I'm not succeeding. There we go. Fences are made. Let's finish off this little thing up here. And I reckon that 
this whole bit's actually going to be oak. Yeah, yeah, that doesn't sound bad. But we do need some lighting here, so I'm not sure what I'm going to do about that. Maybe we can just get away with putting some torches on the fences like so, and um, maybe a bit at the bottom too. And hopefully that gets a bit of light, and maybe we need a bit more. It's not, it's an even number. That's bad. <laughs> even numbers are the worst. If we put that there, and... Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I, I'm, I'm picky. I'm picking, 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 picking about stuff I don't need to be picking about. But, uh, yeah, yep, 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 yep. I do like where this is going right now. I don't know if I showed you guys this pit, actually. And my pickaxe is so quick that I'm breaking all the blocks that are not supposed to be broken. Uh, haste to either love it or hate it. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. I might actually go turn off the haste, seeing as though I don't need it right now. That's a good idea. Ah, oh, I just fell down. Ah, oh, there's no way out. Oh, I've, lucky I've got pills. Anyway, yeah, I'm going to do a little bit more work here and be back with you guys when I'm... I don't know. When I'm doing something that's more video worthy. Because apparently I can't build on camera. So guys, welcome back. Um, I hope you enjoyed that little impromptu time lapse. I wasn't gonna do it, and I was like, nah, I want to do a time lapse this episode. So I did it. I did it, and it's a bit weird because um, uh, you may see clips that are recorded after this one in the time lapse. So before you're seeing this, you will see things that happen after this. I don't know if I'm making sense. But basically, I might rec uh, record some more stuff later on and include that in the time lapse that you just saw. So, yeah, a bit out of order this episode, a bit weird, a bit weird. But, um, yeah, as you can see, I went ahead and did some work off camera. And, well, it might not even look like it was off camera. But I did do some work off camera. Um, 
I added in these areas. These are where the chests are going to go. This side's going to be completely feathers, I think. And on this side, we'll have chicken. Although we might dedicate a couple of the chests to feathers, because we're going to have a lot more feathers than chicken, I imagine, over the time. But, yeah, we'll, we'll see what we do for that. And you saw me build these little farm areas. In fact, where is the bone meal? I was looking for some of that before when, uh, when I was doing the time-lapse and I couldn't figure out where I put it. Yeah, we're just going to spam some bone meal in here, see what happens. Let's get some tall grass up. Jeez, the connection's not good. Neither are the frames, because I'm looking down. I should just not look down. Oh, looking up's not helping either. Come on. Come back to life, computer, please. Oh my god, it's horrible. Oh my god, it's so bad. What is happening? Yeah. Anyway, I am gonna call it a night for now. Tomorrow, it's... I'm getting tired. I'm getting sick of recording for tonight. So tomorrow, I will be back on here. And I'll be finishing off this room, hopefully. We'll work on the redstone mechanics. And just don't look down. We'll work on the redstone mechanics. We'll work on this roof area here. And we should be good by then. We should be good. So I don't think this room is far off completion. And I like where it's going. It's actually turned out pretty good. And it's probably a bit overkill for a ch small chicken farm. I've got to remind myself that I built this entire thing just for a chicken farm. Wow, I'm crazy. Oh yeah, and this bit here is where the item elevator is going to go. So we're going to have an item elevator coming up the middle. And then it will, you know, do its redstone magic behind the wall and drop the items into the chest. And I want to be able to stand here and press a button here probably and have chicken dispensed onto my head. So that'll be a cool way of retrieving chicken, I guess. But yeah, yeah, this is, these are future things. These are future things. And let's place down a bit of bone meal. Cool. Yeah. Anyway, guys, see you guys tomorrow for me. A couple seconds for you. Okay, guys, welcome back. And I didn't do any other stuff for the time lapse. So everything I was saying before is wrong, basically. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I did finish the build in here, the, the aesthetic portion of it at least, and there is that frame rate drop. I hate it! I hate it! I hate it! I hate it! But yeah, as you can see on the wall, I just kind of copied the pattern that we have over here. Uh, I just put in stairs on the parts where it changes, and uh, andesite everywhere else. It's very, very simple, but it does something. Not bad. And in here, to break up the solid andesite, I just put in a little bit of raw andesite. I think that I think that's good. But by now, we're almost ready to get working on the mechanics of this thing, actually. So, yeah, I think we should be doing that very, very soon. And there's a bit of a dark spot there. Maybe I should have put some lights there, but I guess it's only looks. It's not actually going to let mobs spawn or anything. And actually, while I was digging, well, while I was building, I had a creeper explosion. And that wasn't fun. I actually hate creepers so much. Uh, and I, uh, yeah, I, I dug through here as well. So, uh, what damage did we actually do? It's not too bad up here. Um, I did bring some dirt so we could fix it up. Yeah, I thought I might have come through a little bit more, but it's actually not too bad. We can just cover that up with a little bit of dirt. Yeah, definitely not bad, actually. I thought it would have been worse. I thought we might have had to, like, terraform the whole mountain, but it doesn't look to be that way. Not bad. I think that's fixed enough for now. Uh, but, yeah, for now, we're going to work on the redstone, and the first thing we need to do is make that door closable and openable from the inside because it's a little bit useless if you can't close it while you're inside because at the moment this is the only mechanism to open and close the door but it shouldn't be too hard to add in a different one and this chest also will be needing to move just a bunch of stone mm -hmm. uh, yep yeah, so we'll put in red stone like a sou and I think this should be all we have to do to wire it up to the door. 
and let's place back our blocks. That one and that one. We should be able to place the button and we should see the door activating. Fingers crossed. Ah. Uh, no. What? All oh, right, it needs to be inverted. That is not a problem. We can just put a redstone torch on there. That's the wrong bit of redstone dust. That is also the wrong piece of redstone dust. A redstone torch. Let's see. There we go. Redstone torch. Activate. And now we should be working. Fingers crossed once again. Get that button on there. Come on. that doesn't work. I am actually surprised that that does not work. I'm confused. <laughs> Let's try a repeater. Maybe that, maybe that's the problem, but I don't see. Oh. Yeah, I, I've, I've, yeah, okay. It's still remaining powered from this other side, isn't it? That's actually really annoying because because of that we're gonna have to move the whole thing. Oh, maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe. Ooh, that broke something. I hope not. Maybe we can do that, and then we do. We'll do this one. I think we should be able to just redirect the redstone, and that should fix it. To be honest. All right. So that. And we can get rid of that little inverter here. So now I think we're cracking. I think. Oh, what happened then? So that that closes it. Good. And opens it. Good. <laughs> That's the start. And I want to take my blocks off my bar because I always break that item frame. <gasps> it works. The red star works, guys. It's amazing. <sighs> I I. Oh, I'm happy. I'm happy that that works. I'm very, very happy that that works. And that is incorrect. Let's place those back in the correct place this time. I'm very, very glad that that worked. Took way longer than I should have, but we've got a button on the inside now. <laughs> anyway, yeah, I need to plan out what we're going to be doing for this item transportation thing. And I should probably actually spawn in the chickens. Make sure the thing works before we do something crazy. Did I leave a good way in here? Oh, we've got mobs... I probably should have lit this place up. Yeah, that's where the chickens will go. So I should probably spawn in some chickens and be back with you guys when we're working on a bit of the redstone stuff. So I've thrown in about an inventory full of eggs here and we've actually got quite a few chickens. We may not have to put any more uh, in after I've done this. But it actually turns out that we're running low on time for this episode. This episode has gone quick. Most definitely has gone quick, and I'm going to try to walk out of here backwards so I don't end up by looking at those hoppers that ruin my frame rate. And I had to look down anyway. Anyway, uh, yeah, we are almost out of time for this episode, which is hard to believe. This has definitely been a quick episode. I need my pickaxe out. Alright, uh, we're going to take a bunch of stone, and I'm going to show you a thing. I think I might have briefly showed it to you guys when I did Isaac's base tour with him. But I wanna I wanna show you guys again. Um the stone exchange thing, that is really cool. It's really cool. I it's given me ideas. I wanna like make a bunch of exchange where people can just dump the stuff and we can share our resources because I don't know, that just seems really cool that um we could do that. If that's doable, I'll be happy. It'll be, yeah, I don't know. It just, collaboration, working together, nothing gets wasted. It's good, it's good. I like it. And, I mean, if I need that stone, I'm sure there'll be a lot in there. But if there's not, it's not hard to get more stone, is it? And this thing. I saw this thing the other day briefly. I haven't had a good look at it yet. I think that Matt was saying he built this. I hope I'm not spoiling it. I don't think I am, because I don't think Matt wants to record this at all. But, uh, yeah. Interesting, interesting roof, I must say. But I do like the build a lot. The build is really cool. Um, stuff. 
I do like it. Is there a better place where we can go? Do I have ender pearls? Of course I don't have ender pearls. Do I have blocks? I don't have blocks. I do have blocks, actually. Let's pull her up here a little and see what it looks like. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I wonder what it's going to be. I don't actually know. Hmm. I guess we wait and see. What are you doing? There's supposed to be no spawning spots around here. And there was one other thing that I wanted to show you guys. Uh, let's pop down here. I hope I'm not spoiling it for Glow either. But Glow's been working on a thing in spawn. Uh, I think if he didn't want me spoiling it, he would have said something. Uh, but yeah, this is, I believe, a shop of some sort. Gl hardened clay, maybe? I'm pretty sure I read somewhere it was a hardened clay shop. Is there a sign? I thought there was a sign. I'm hungry! Ah, feed me! Yeah, I thought there was a sign around here. Maybe it, maybe there was and it's gone. Maybe I'm crazy. But I was pretty sure this was belonging to Glow, and I was pretty sure it was a clay shop. But if I'm wrong, it's not my fault, okay? Nothing in the chest yet. Interesting, interesting. Why can't I run? Oh, I can. It's just that I'm so used to speed, and when the speed's gone, it feels weird. What's going on in here? Free spruce doors? Nobody wants the spruce doors. Isn't that sad? How's my sugarcane farm doing? <laughs> Not very well, by the looks of it. Melon. Pumpkin. Actually, what am I doing? I'm supposed to be looking in these chests. See if they need crafting up. I don't think they do, though. But anyway, guys, I am going to have to call it there for this episode. So if you guys enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe, rate, do whatever you want to do. It all does help. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.